Whoa, 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 you saw that? Whoa, whoa, you saw that? You saw that? You saw that? I played Indigo Park, chapter one. I forgot the name of chapter one, but I did play chapter one. And here's how it turned out. All right, so we're playing Indigo Park. This is gonna be fun. Look at the little guy over there. What is this? Hey, it's it's like the opening to Disneyland. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Yo, he's got Discord set up. Look at that. Why does this remind me of the Finance at Freddy's movie intro? I'm such a loser. He's got the YouTubes as well. Let's go. That intro went hard. Now, if you don't know what Indigo Park is, luckily I'm here to tell you what Indigo Park is. Indigo Park is an indie horror mascot game by Unique Geese. This whole project started over a year ago, right after he remade Garden of Ban Ban Chapter 1 in under a week with absolutely zero game development skills. And it actually turned out really good. Like, he really cooked with that. Why didn't the original creators of Garden of Ban Ban cook? I have no idea. But after that, he decided to create his own indie mascot game called Indigo Park. And now, over a year later, we finally have the game. And well, it's pretty cool, but it's got some issues. Okay. Why is this? Ooh, this is. I don't like how. I don't like how fast this is. Okay. This this works way better. I've been following this game loosely. Why are the polygons so bad? Is this just my game? I think this might be my game. I'm not sure if it's meant to be this quality or not. I highly doubt it. Look at that. I don't know, man. And a lot of issues I dealt with during my gameplay was completely my own. All right, let's try this again. Hopefully the quality is better. Welp. It's still low quality. Maybe just my computer sucks. That could be it. All right, so a little bit of information that I have about this game. So I loosely followed this game, but I was waiting to play it and I can't tell what that's supposed to be. So we're going to continue. I like the whole Disneyland inspired aesthetic. Luckily for me, I am an indie horror expert. I I hear weird noises. I never get scared of indie horror games. Oh, yeah. sh oh, sh get out, get out, get out, close the door, close the door. I am a pro at this. I don't like the sounds though. Hi, Whoa! Hey, welcome to hey buddy. That's crazy. Thank you. I'm Rambly? Rambly? Sure Rambly? Which one? What? He's got to clean up his desk a little bit. That's crazy. Yes, it is. Did it not have a date? It said 20XX. What year are we in? It sucks that I can't experience this game in a higher quality, but also to be fair, it is entirely my fault I'm in this situation. So hopefully I could get this looking better. Oh, hold up. The gate is open. Oh, it's and not. Dumbass. What do you want me to do? I wasn't paying attention. Gotta be something here. Oh, nope. Bro, I do not like these noises, man. Nostalgia, damn right. Oh, there we go. Ah, uh, typical indie horror fashion. Oh, look at that. Oh, you could pick it up too? There you go. Jeez, that was much easier than Bendy. I don't like the noises. I don't like the noises. Whoa, this is just like Disney. That's not like Disney though. You usually can see the characters. Look at the plushes. Watch, I bet, I bet. Here's my little prediction here. All those will become a real thing that you can buy. That's my little prediction. Why is the sign look like a Minecraft photo? I'm sorry, I, I, I'm judging this game based off of my own issues. <laughs> I like how they just have little guys chilling around. That's crazy. Oh shit, they're going all in on the Disney parks. I respect that. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, watch. I bet we're going to have a nerd collectible. There's going to be a bad guy in here. And then the bad guy is going to chase us. And that's the end of the chapter. That's my little prediction here. I, 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 know, I know these games a bit too well. I would honestly get a Rambly. You know, have them on my desk. Where am I supposed to go? Shit, they got pins too? Oh no, those aren't pins. Did they got pins? I'm a pin collector, so I like to see if they got pins. I don't think they got pins. This is pretty disappointing. Oh, I should probably follow the arrows. That would help. There you go, buddy. Yeah, shut up. That also doubles as a pedometer, heart monitor, and moon ring. This is a bit more fancy than a magic band. Where am I supposed to go now? Oh, I'm supposed to go back. Wait, why can't they? Why is there an invisible wall here? What? Okay, so it turns out I might have been wrong about this uh -oh. whole thing. The door mysteriously locked. Why not test out your band and save the day? Huh? This is literally Magic Band at Disney. Holy shit. Hooray! Great work, buddy. 
Thanks, buddy. So far, I'm liking this. this is kind of, it's kind of a bit different. <laughs> if only my computer could actually run the game, I might actually have a way better experience playing this. Oh, did they got Dippin' Dots over here? I gotta check this out. Ah, uh, no Dippin' Dots. You know, if they really want to go in on Disney, they need to have like some Indigo Park popcorn buckets, you know, do some wacky shit. Their most popular products are the popcorn buckets. Look at that, bird up, damn right. Oh, look at that. Whoa. What's going on here? Oh. Whoa, this entire thing happened off screen. Damn, that sucks. But well, the lights turned on though, so that's a positive. And we're by the bathrooms too. Holy shit, th the quality has gone up. What the? What's this? What's going on here? I wanna look at these posters real quick. I love these old timey posters. Molly McCaws Rooftop Races. I hope that's a roller coaster. All about Ramblies. Let me turn off the light. Finley at the Oceanic Odyssey. Okay, these these could be a couple things. This could be like the Finding Nemo ride at Epcot. This could be Journey into uh, Nemo. In I don't remember what the ride is. You know what I'm talking about. Could be that. Um, but I can't think of anything else. Forever, I've wanted a, a horror game set in a theme park. And I'm really glad a game like this actually does exist. Oh, look at that. It's, it's uh... What's her name? Hold on. Molly McCaw. Look at that. It's Molly McCock and Rambly. Oh, Rambly's Railroad. Let's see here. Let's see here. Can I open it? I... Ah, oh, damn, I can't. This sucks. Our oh. Looks like the park is going through some renovations. I like your attitude, Rambly. That's crazy. What I need to do? Oh, so it was open. I just didn't move far enough for the thingy to the thingy. I don't know what you're doing, Molly McCock, but I don't appreciate it. Oh, look at the statue. Why is my game running lower now? What's this? What's going on here? Okay, nice, nice. Like the whole Disney TV thing. Oh, they don't really do that. Oh, you saw that shit? You know why Rambly the raccoon loves Rambly's Railroad? Why? Because I like trains. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh shit, that scared me. So my little prediction on how this game will end is that like, um, my guess is Molly McCall is gonna be chasing us and we're gonna have to like run away. And I know for a fact I'm gonna die because my controller is being a pain in the ass. All right, let's get on here. Oh, wrong button. I like this, I like, oh, we're not gonna see the full thing. Okay, so there's no lights in here. So we're gonna leave this on. Oh, now there's lights, this is bullshit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so this is is the most like Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway, ra 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 Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Banger ride by the way. I like Rambly's vibe man. He's just vibing out. Oh, there's Molly McCaw. What? Oh. It's Molly McCaw. It's Molly McCaw. Yeah. Damn right. Oh. That's a good question. Uh, I see. I got you. I got you. Huh. Whoa, 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 you saw that shit? Whoa, whoa, you saw that? You saw that? You saw that? It's good thing I turned my light on. We might not have been able to see them. She's gonna, like, appear over here, right? Oh, no, never mind. There's walls. Okay. Look at the moonlight. I like this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, because this looks like a door. Oh. It is a door. Oh, bro, I know this fucker's gonna be showing up somewhere. Whoa, shit. I did not get scared. Ah, it's one of these things. Shit. I'm not liking this. I'm not liking this. I'm not liking this. Okay, we're all back to normal, it seems. Where is she? She's nowhere. Okay. Honestly, no. It kind of sucked. It was pretty mid. Oh, shit. Look at that. Oh, wait. There's a bird right there. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, I like this view. This is a nice view. Is that really how you get to the park, though? Kind of a shitty way to get to the park. Wouldn't it just be easier to make a path to it? Huh. I wonder what time it is. I think we're gonna head to the theater. Mostly because uh, it's lit up, so I'm assuming we're supposed to go that direction. Oh. Huh. Where are we supposed to go then? I don't like that. What do you mean, go over there? Well, I can't go in there, so maybe it is a good thing to follow you. But where did you... Where did you come from? When I ask you about it, just stop by right here and I'll ramble on about it. Uh, I see what you did there. Oh, there's a plot. Oh, I guess we're gonna have to head this direction. Check. There's a security office in the back of the theater. Maybe 
The theater was closed. I can't go to the theater. Orange level access. Ah, this is just security breach all over again. The lights turned on again. They knew I was coming. Oh, now it works. Okay, what is going on here? There's too many load screens, man. There's so many load screens. Every single location we go to, load screen. Oh, he's dead. Oh, wait. I just saw his leg twitch and his tail's moving. Maybe the bird isn't gonna kill us, it's gonna be them. Okay, we're gonna do this real quietly. Okay, that thing is moving. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh good. I thought it was gonna chase us for a second. Imagine like getting chased and there's like a load screen. Ah, oh, that would suck. We gotta go over in there. Ah, oh, we're dead, man. We're toast. Where did the giant ass lion go? This is up there, but even then, that's not big enough for it. And you would see it. Oh. Sorry, chair. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, am I? I'm stuck. How did this happen? This isn't good. Um. Welp. Um, I can't move. So after I stopped recording the video, I decided to go back into the game and I had a way better experience because my computer could only handle one application at a time. Yo, you seen it? You seen that shit? Look at that. Look at that. He's just staring at me. What do you want, bitch? You're a coward. I don't like that. I don't like that growl though. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna stop now. But yeah, after playing it the way it was pretty much intended to be, I still had some issues, but as a whole, it was pretty much how it was intended. I really like this game. It is really fun. He just keeps staring at me, man. Go away, bro. Don't you have a life? Bro, you got the Sonic EXE eyes, okay? You shouldn't be staring at me. So far, we're only at the first chapter, so we probably have a few more on the way. I know we're already gonna get a chapter two. It's already been funded, which is great to hear. The lion walked that way and there's nowhere over there for him to go. So where did he go? This is probably one of my favorite indie horror games we've gotten in the last few years. Whoa, what are you doing, bitch? <laughs> you stupid asshole, dumbass, stupid ass. Yeah, run away like a bitch. I did not like Poppy's Playtime. I know that's kind of a hot take, and I absolutely do not like Gar in a Ban Ban. There's some other indie horror games here and there, but as a whole, the whole mascot indie horror genre, I just haven't been vibing with it the last few years. The only recent one I liked is Security Breach, but that, that's about it. Even then, I, Security Breach isn't amazing either. It takes the usual indie horror mascot approach by doing chapters, and it ends exactly how it's gonna end. I'm not gonna tell you what happens, but trust me, you know how it's gonna end. This is literally security breach. Oh, shit. I know what's gonna happen. Damn. But it feels like as if they actually cooked. First off, I gotta say, I love the fact that this entire game takes place in a theme park, so it kind of warrants having these big grand areas because it's supposed to be a Disney and Universal type park, so it's gonna be grand in scale. So it makes sense here compared to a fucking daycare. I Why is a daycare this big? I'm sorry, I lost my train of thought for a second. Usually in the first chapter, you're really introduced to one character that you don't really see that much throughout the first chapter, and then at the end, boom, you see him, get chased, they die, the end. But here you kind of see him throughout the entire duration. You see the main antagonist throughout, but also you get to see uh, the, the lion guy. Just as a whole, it's a really fun game, and I highly recommend you check it out. Uh, this is how I'm going to end it. Uh, I'm not really a gameplay guy. I don't really, I haven't made that many gameplay videos on this channel, and most of them for, from like three years ago. So hopefully this actually turned out good. If not, I'm sorry. So, so, so why? <laughs>